Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our MCs for tonight, Mr. Paul Chan and Mr. Castro Liu. Music, welcome everybody. We were just <laughs> He's got his gangnam on. Next we have Mr. Dennis O. Young, Chairman of the Board of Governors of Munchong Foundation. Mr. Frank Chow, First Vice Chairman of Munchong Foundation. Please welcome Ms. Doris Chan, the Second Vice Chairman of the Munchong Foundation. And Mr. Eddie Sang, Vice Chairman. Simon Sang, co-chair of the Cafe Ball. <laughs> Miss Amy Wong, co-chair of Cafe Ball. <laughs> okay, I can see there's a dance competition going on here. Anthem. 我请大家一起,我们起立唱国歌 Thank you, Colin and Castro. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Cafe Ball 2012 on this cool, beautiful autumn day. First, I thank co chairs Amy Wong, Clement Sang, the organizing committee, sponsors, volunteers, youth groups members, and staff. They have worked very hard in the past few months to prepare for this evening. Our mission is caring for the elderly and nurture the young. Fulo Zi Yao. Here is a video message for this ball. Since 
Since 1964, Mungshan Foundation has been working tirelessly in its mission of caring for the elderly and nurturing the young. Today we have 457 long-term care beds in three locations, an adult daycare center, 242 units of senior apartments, two community and volunteer services centers, the largest Chinese heritage school in Canada with over 1,100 students, and a vibrant and very active youth group of 350. In the years to come, the major challenge is to satisfy the needs of the ever-increasing number of seniors in the areas of independent living, assisted care, and full care. In Richmond Hill, a new complex is being built to house two Munshan Court buildings with 311 senior apartments and one private care facility with 43 assisted care units and 110 full care beds. Likewise, in Markham, we will do the same and will house another 453 senior apartments together with assisted care units and full care beds. Now Munshang is faced with a heart-wrenching challenge to deal with the long waiting list of over 2,600 for our long-term care beds with a wait time between three and seven years long. During the waiting period, the seniors cannot receive professional care. For family members taking care of them, they too are strained. If family members have to give up their jobs to care for their loved ones, it further burdens them financially. Therefore, Munshang is building 110 full care beds in Richmond Hill to meet this urgent need and provide temporary relief. Munshang will offer 80 private beds for those who can afford to pay and 30 subsidized beds for those who can't. The subsidized beds program by Munshang is a first of its kind in Canada and we are very proud that they will be ready at the end of 2013. To maintain the operation of these 30 beds, we need lots of volunteers and about $3,000 per bed per month or $1 million a year. We need your help and generosity to make it work. Please volunteer with us or donate through naming the buildings, rooms, beds, or tables and chairs. Please extend your kind hands to our frail seniors. Thank you. I read a report on our demographics. Thanks to research, medicine and innovations, Canada and most of the countries around the world will face the largest percentage of seniors in the entire history of mankind. The good news, we'll most likely live much longer. But tonight is also about seeing old friends and meeting new ones to relax and enjoy the entertainment, to be in Seoul, Korea, to dance together, the opera Gangnam style. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, have a wonderful evening. Ladies and gentlemen, you know how hard it is to organize a party for a few people. An event of this size takes an awful lot of work. Let's give them a